expect more. I'm the I'm just the kind of person I want more from my spiritual life personally. I want more for my church. I want more for my family. You remember I told you the miracle I'm praying for? My big miracle. I want more for my daughter. I just want to tell you, expect it. You got to expect it in your marriage. You got to expect it in your children. You got to expect it in your money. You got to expect it in your kids. You got to expect it where you work. You got to expect it in your career. You got to expect it in your calling. You got to expect it in your life. You got to expect it in your home. You got to expect it in your bedroom. You got to expect it in the kitchen. You got to expect more. If you believe all the lies of Satan, you'll never expect anything. And yet God has come to the party. And there's a reason to celebrate because you're not going to believe those lies anymore. That things can't get better. That he's not going to listen. That she's not going to change. Here's what I want you to know. You really can't expect to change anyone. You can only expect to influence them. It's God's job to change them. And I'd say this. It's not right to think it you just need more faith and it'll get better. For any more faithers, do you think the disciples had faith? They all died. And there's a tradition that says John, the one who didn't die, was boiled in a pot of water. So if you said they just needed more faith and you're saying no one but Jesus had the right amount of faith, that's not fair. So I just propose today to us, expect more. And maybe God will do it in an action, but probably it's going to be in the process. And it's probably going to be along the way.